Welcome to the lab. 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 Come on and cook with me. GG's gluten free. Bake with me. GG's gluten free. Grill with me. GG's gluten free. Eat with me. to the lab everyone if this is your first time i welcome you with open arms if you are a returning subscriber thank you thank you thank you and to all of my members thank you thank you thank you i love you i appreciate you this channel would not exist without any of you guys so i welcome you i say thank you and i appreciate you here we're doing a few product reviews this one right here krakatoa hot chips these are very, very hot black magic Creole heat with ghost peppers. Oh yeah, I'm, I, they say the, 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 the spice intensifies as you eat them. One chip is said to have 38,700 Scoville units of hotness. Yeah. The location, they say, is the tongue, the throat, the lips, and the eyes. So, and guess what, guys? Yes, they are gluten-free. And yes, they are made with ghost pepper, habanero pepper, cayenne pepper, and chipotle peppers. Yes, guys, they're vegan, non-GMO, and they are gluten-free. So, we brought a few friends to, um, yeah, a few friends <laughs> so that if I fall short, at least I would have did an honest review on two other products. So, we have the gluten-free honey dip chicken corn dogs by Foster Farm as well as the Vans gluten-free the perfect chip cracker along with some albacore tuna that I have pre-prepared. Yeah, so we're going to do that and um so everything you see pictured here is gluten-free, including the mustard. The mustard by French's, yes, it is gluten-free, guys. And when you live in a household with people that may not be gluten-free and don't follow gluten-free lifestyle, if you buy your condiments in a bottle that can, where you can squeeze it, that makes it a whole lot easier. So we're going to start off with the corn dogs. Yep, so we can, you know, lace our palate with something subtle before we get into the cocoa hot kettle chips. Okay, guys. So I'm, I heard that they the hottest. I heard it's only going to take one chip. So I'm going to start off here first. Mm. Wow. That's good, guys. I haven't had a corn dog in years. So, guys. If you have a taste for a corn dog, you should definitely try Foster Farms gluten-free corn dogs. And they're made with a chicken dog. This is good. Mmm. Yeah. Really good, guys. So, guys, I know we have fun. But we still have to keep our diet. We got to be silly, have fun, eat snack. But you, what you want to do is make sure you keep your diet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is really good, guys. We have to review products. There's so many gluten-free products out there. There's no need to eat the same thing over and over. Mm. You just pop them in the oven and let them warm up. Every now and then, I want a snack. I don't want to eat big. I just want to snack a little bit. That's when something like this come in handy. Well, 
I want to get my palette ready. <laughs> Pocatoa. I'm hurt. There's a scale. And the scale is volcanic, on fire, spicy, and nothing. So we have the black magic, and it's at the top, at the very top. So I'm about to take some of these crackers. Guys, if you gluten free and you miss crackers, if you eat these crackers, you can eat them plain. I'm telling you, Vans, the perfect 10, guys. I've already had them before, but I want to show you guys another product. So we have these. So I'm getting them ready because I heard that these chips are on fire. And I decided to make sure I would do this video when I have someone at home with me, just in case. And then here's my water. I'm getting ready, y'all. Oh, they don't look hot. 38,700 Scoville units per chip. So here we go. <laughs> Amen. Uh huh. Mm. Mm. I'm pretty hot. Mm. That's pretty hot. Ooh. I'm getting hot, y'all. Physically hot. Mmm. I'm pretty hot. But you know how you have some <clears throat> that's so hot or whatever that you may not be able to enjoy it? So they hot. But this is the type of chip Wow, it's like taking over the right side of my palate. Oh, you just would not eat but one or two of these and keep it moving. It's really hot. I expected it to be much hotter, but it's too hot to eat on a regular basis. Yeah. Mm. It's really hot. It's hot. That's enough for me. I told you it's a product review, okay? They're not nasty. They're just too hot to eat on a regular basis. But the corn dogs, on point. Um, like I told you, when I do a product review, I don't like to rate the products. And... They're not bigging it up by just saying that they hot. They are hot, but I can tolerate it. You see, I was able to eat it without drinking water. But they hot. But they're not bad, though. Let me get one more. Let me see. But I start getting physically hot. Like, I want a fan. I need a fan. Let me see. And along with something else, you're not that hot. It's cool to eat with something else. Corn dogs on point. I'm very happy. I'm very happy with the corn dog. Mm. Now, 
we'll have to do our cracker and our tuna. I like these kind of product reviews right here. Mm-hmm. Let's see. This is albacore tuna, guys. Mm. Mm. That's good. The tip is making my nose run, guys. A little hot, though. This is good. I'm going to try one of these. And the tuna. I like to see somebody eat these in a challenge. But nothing else on the side. Not me. Somebody else. Now, like I said, along with something else, they really aren't that hot. But they're too hot to eat on a regular basis. Oh, yeah. Way too hot. You know, you got some people that their whole diet consists of eating spicy and hot. That's not me. Not your girl. But we will continue to try products before you buy them. Yes, we will try products before you buy them. So just stick around. Continue to follow us on our gluten-free journey here at Gigi's Gluten-Free Lab. We will provide you with the reviews on the new products as they come out. That's right, guys. We are out here and we are testing products. We're trying to get slowly back into the restaurant reviews. Um, we're here. We're over 400 videos, guys. Over 400 videos. So go back and check a few of the videos out. Share me out. You may be a parent, a partner, a co-worker, a neighbor, or a friend of someone with a gluten intolerance. Guys, tell them about Gigi's Gluten-Free Lab. We are here to help. If you have questions, if you have things you want me to try, just drop me a line. Um, you can email me. You can hit me on IG. You can hit me under one of these videos. Whatever it is, I appreciate you being here. And if you want to know something, I'm here to share. So, we're going to wrap this up. Um, if you are seeing this video now, this is hump day and starting back on Friday, we will pick back up with our Thanksgiving dishes. Yes, we will. Um, we have vegetables coming. We have a few more desserts. We are already done turkey wings and I believe I will be doing a hen or Cornish hens next. Till next time. Cook with me, bake with me, eat with me. Gigi's gluten free. Welcome to the lab. Welcome to the lab.